Now to the catastrophic flooding in eastern Kentucky. The state's governor said search and rescue operations ongoing in that region swamped by torrential rains. At least 25 people, including four children, killed after flash flooding swept through. Now dozens of pets are displaced because of the flooding as well, and they're in southeast Wisconsin, hoping to again find a forever home. CBS 58's Jenna Wells reports from Racine County. Rescue Outreach has been partnering with a shelter in Hazard, Kentucky for years, doing intakes every two weeks. But due to devastating flooding in that area, this week's intake was critical. Floodwaters in Kentucky leading to displaced animals and suffering shelters like Rescue Outreach in Union Grove's longtime partner, the Kentucky River Regional Animal Shelter. At this point, last I knew they were running the shelter on one generator. Um, it's not even enough to handle their air conditioning, their um, air handling systems, and they need some place to keep animals. With dozens of animals in need, Rescue Outreach put out a plea for help on social media asking for pet supply donations. We had a tremendous outpouring of support just from our local community here. Uh, we were able to fill up a 15-foot uh, gooseneck trailer full of supplies. And after a long trip, 60 animals from Kentucky arrived in Union Grove Saturday for some tender, loving care. We will begin bathing, looking them over, getting them microchipped, updating vaccinations if needed. We've already gathered our supplies, and once they're ready, they'll go to foster homes for their two-week hold period. While the process has been overwhelming, the work is so important for the nonprofit volunteers at Rescue Outreach. It's definitely a labor of love that has a really rewarding outcome. With a little bit of rest and rehabilitation, those 60 animals from Kentucky, including this little guy, will eventually be up for adoption here at Rescue Outreach. In Union Grove, Jenna Wells, CBS 58 News. Three bystanders.